Pakistan's bicameral system is a form of government that has two chambers or houses in the legislature. The two houses are the Senate and the National Assembly, which together make up the Parliament of Pakistan. According to the Constitution of 1973, the President is also a part of the Parliament. This system is observed in several countries like India, Bangladesh, United States and United Kingdom, among others. The main objective of having such a legislative system is to ensure checks and balances in the lawmaking of the state and avoid hijacking of the legislative system. For political or personal advancement by the political parties or individuals with great pull in either sphere. The Senate represents the provinces equally. It has 104 members who are elected by the provincial assemblies and the Islamabad capital territory for six years' terms. The Senate has the power to review and approve the bills passed by the National Assembly. The National Assembly is the lower house of the parliament, representing the people based on the population. It has 336 members elected by the voters directly for five-year terms. The National Assembly has the power to pass laws and control the finances of the country. Each election season, citizens cast their votes for representatives in their constituencies. These votes are cast for both national and provincial assembly seats. These votes go on to determine which candidates will make up the lower house of the parliament, the national assembly. As for the provincial assemblies, the elected members then vote to elect members of the upper house or the senate of Pakistan. The process of making laws in Pakistan involves several steps in both houses of the parliament. Any member of the parliament, a minister or a committee can introduce a bill. The bill goes through three readings in each house, where it is presented, debated, and amended. After both houses pass the bill, it goes to the president for assent. The president can either sign the bill into law or send it back to the parliament for reconsideration. If the president does not act on the bill within 10 days, it becomes law automatically.